Dear students, in this module, I am going to elaborate on the quaternary structures of the proteins. The quaternary structure, or simply the four prime structure of a protein, describes how a polypeptide chain talks with another polypeptide chain. The four prime structures of the quaternary structures are formed when different polypeptide chains they come together via hydrogen bonds, electrostatic interactions, and other types of interactions as well. An important thing that you should consider for this is that there are multimeric proteins and mo monomeric proteins. So if you have a monomer, monomeric protein, then the tertiary structure will describe the entire protein structure. But if you have a multimeric protein in which uh, different polypeptides they come together and make a structure then the quaternary structure is the complete structure for that protein. So as I just mentioned the proteins comprising of a single chain of amino acids they can have a monomeric structure or the tertiary structure while for the polypeptide chains which are acting together to make a structure then they will give rise to a quaternary structure and that will be the overall structure of that protein. To give you an example here you have a quaternary structure and you can identify if you look closely the yellow portion describes several alpha helices coming together in the form of a tertiary structure and then they are interacting with this green alpha helices in order to give rise to a quaternary structure and moreover you see these blue alpha helices talking with the orange alpha helices and also making a multimeric polypeptide also if you look at the cyan alpha helices they are talking with the green alpha helices and they are holding entire structure together so therefore by simply coming together and holding each other these monomeric polypeptide chains have given rise to a multimeric protein so this describe the quaternary structure for this protein so this will be the overall structure for this single protein now instead of the tertiary structure that we discussed earlier so in conclusion the four prime structures are formed as a result of hydrogen bond formations covalent bond formations such as the disulfide bridges and electrostatic interactions of course the hydrophobic interactions as well so these interactions they force the monomeric polypeptides to take form and take shape as a single protein. The underlying philosophy is that the one prime structure is less stable, the two prime structure that is the alpha helices beta sheets they are more stable but the tertiary structure is even more stable wherein the alpha helices beta sheets coils and loops they come together while the four prime structure or the quaternary structure is the most stable protein structure that you have all the proteins they are aiming for evolving from the one prime structure to the quaternary or the four prime structure and the underlying principle is their increased stability 